have that same skill set to play up tempo, kind of the drive and crash, the shake and bake. They're going to need to do a little bit of that if they want a chance here. Oi. Deal two. First point on the board. That was a really well played point though on all parties. And I like the shot selection from Dazon, but that's why I said it's the deception, it's the ability to find those sneakier off pace attacks that you're gonna need. And she just wasn't able to convert on that occasion. One more for Waters and Johns. That's a big overhead of Ben Johns. Yeah, once he gets one of those forehands in the middle, hey, two. Uh, big, big favorites to win the point. Point. Quick to the backhand side of Stackstrude. 4-0-2. Johns is everywhere to start this match, being nicely set up from some aggressive placement by Annalie Waters. Five, zero, two. Yeah. Yeah. Side out. And a side out for Stackstrude and Dazon. Megan Dazon. Zero five one. Loves utilizing that Pro Connects paddle. She creates plenty, plenty of her own power off that as she goes for the third shot drive. Second serve. Yeah, just rose up a little bit on that drive attempt. So important to stay down to keep those drives nice Zero and low. Zero five two. Side up. Tough when the number one female in the game and the number Five, one zero, male one. in the game play alongside one another. Point. So fun to just watch the foot speed of Ben Johns. Yeah, and this is as active as I've seen his feet to yes. start a match. He's coming out trying to send a message, Six, and it's working so far. Second Oftentimes, serve. he'll kind of settle his way into a match. Right now, they are firing. 6-0-2. Winning the firefight. Yeah, not only did he handle the onslaught of attacks from Ben Johns, but he slid over and read the location of this dig Zero, perfectly. Six, one. Second serve. Second serve now. Federico Stackstrude. Zero six two. Out. Trying to get creative. Yeah, that's the pressure that these aggressive dinks can cause. Six, zero, one. You're not wanting to play defense the whole time, so it makes you press a little bit on times where you initiate attacks. Point. Annalie, I love this. This is one of the best parts of Ben and Annalie playing alongside one another. Time Just how flawless. I know, it's crazy. Come in. Seven, I would zero, be lying one. if I uh, said I haven't been beat by a 12-year-old before in a pickleball court. Point. Eight zero one.
second serve. Looked like Annalie Waters going for almost a, a hybrid Chilton. drive drop. Very close to the net. She's been converting on those, though. Point. I also liked in chatting with Ben and Annalie, they talked about the triple crowns. We said, are you competitive with Not one Jill another? Too. Their answer was, nah, we spur each other on, yet they know exactly how <laughs> many the other has in their career. I think that was the real answer <laughs> as, to, <laughs> as to how much it matters to them. <laughs> Ben was airborne on that last ball. <laughs> I was just going to say, that's not very common for him. <laughs> His eyes got very big there. Attacking the toes of Staxrud. Second serve. Yeah, and it's such a tough team to do the shake and bake against because Zero normally when you're doing the shake and bake, you drive middle, but it's both the strengths of Annalie Waters with her backhand and the forehand of Ben Johns. Annalie Point. looking for the finesse Ernie. Yeah, a rare sighting with her on the left, and she goes right full commitment for the Ernie attempt. One, nine, two. Ben John's doing wild things out there. I was so impressed by the one he sent all the way back cross court, but Federico Stackshirt had a good response. Yeah, they've had their cat and mouse battles in singles. It almost felt like Nine that one type one. of point for a little while here on the double side. Point. That's a new element in 2023 for Ben Johns. Two-hand backhand kind of misdirect, speed up, up the line. It's going to be scary as he gets more comfortable with that shot. Point game switch. 11 to 1 in game one. Ben and Anna Lee. Cameron Irwin alongside Kyle McKenzie. And a little bit of a slow start in their quarterfinal matchup. So let's see if Stackstrud and Dazan can find the same solution. Point. After game one. Yeah, definitely a different animal on the other side of the court. I mean, if you're in their camp now, I think you just got to keep it simple as far as any strategy adjustments. Just focus one, zero, on one. getting to the kitchen, neutralizing the point when you can, and then being as calculated and aggressive as you can once the point is equal. That just goes to show Second you, you serve. have to hit six balls to get it down on Ben and Annalie. Yeah, it's amazing how Annalie Waters especially can One just continue two. attacking effectively, even when she's out of position. Point. Yeah, it's an interesting lesson, right? Because often we tell the amateurs as well as two zero two. the rest of the pros, even to that point that attacks need to be on balance. But Annalie Waters, one of the best while on the move. Point. Yeah, I mean, the, the old conventional thinking was, you know, get to the kitchen line, then get aggressive. Three, but zero, the modern game is proving that you do not have to be perfectly established before you're able to find some aggressive shots and, and be effective with those. Point. The tempo of play seems to be affecting Dazon at the moment. She's Four, just struggling zero, a little bit with her touch. That's a sweet ATP from Annalie Waters. Yeah, it's always demoralizing when you hit a nice roll cross court ball, Five, zero, but it just two. gives them a little bit too much angle and you pay the price. Ben John's still looking at it. It was spinning about four different directions. <laughs> yeah, that was very shallow to the net. He didn't have a lot of options other than just <gasps> lifting it back in front of him. Five, one. He gave a sorry to his partner right there. 
Point. Yeah, Ben opting for the two-hander. <laughs> We've just seen that ball a little bit one, higher. 1-5-1. One. <laughs> that was so timely. Point. Another miss to the side, and Federico Stackstrude starting to make some noise. Two, oh, five, one. that guy is right on cue with the horn. Anna Lee again Second off serve. the corner. Yeah, great read by her, realizing that Ben got enough stick on that cross-court dink and that Stackstrom wouldn't have a lot of other options. Yeah. Ooh, that was like lightning, those hands so fast from Stackstrom. Yeah, and that's been the area of his game that I've really seen jump up in the last few months. Three, five, two. Very clean on a lot of his counters, much tougher to attack than he was uh, six months to a year back. Side out. Teams have tried this multiple times, going up and over the top of Annalise's head. Not a bad play, and a lot of times you do need to look for times to Five, change three, the pattern when you're playing uh, this very, very difficult number one team. Second serve. Beautiful roll from Stackstrude, making the perfect contact. Five, three, two. Set out. All of a sudden, Anna Lee jumps into the mix. Yeah, she set herself up nicely. Normally, that's going to be Three, one that she converts one. on. Second serve. Second serve now for Federico Stackstrude and Megan Dazon. Just two back. Go, Megan! Three, five, two. What was that? How did that roll well, like that? Right well, it looked like it hit the net. And any time it hits the net, that angle Side can out. get more severe. Not Ben Johns' first rodeo. He knew that the angle would open up, had a relatively About three, easy one. ATP to finish. It looked like he was just like walking his dog casually across the length of the net, waiting for it. Point. Dizon a little frustrated that she wasn't able to time that uh, counter Six, a little three, better. One. Point. Seven, three, one. Yeah. Second serve. Some power off Stackstrude's paddle. Ben and Anna Lee again Seven, looking three, to find Championship Sunday. Both of them on to the singles final. And Annalise hoping to find a Point. fifth straight triple crown. Timeout receiving team, 3 8 2. Out of the timeout. Out of bounds. I saw the ball in. And they're going to question in. this yep. one. <laughs> ben right isn't sure that wasn't in. They, yeah, Dazon put her finger up and looked at Ben, almost like a question mark. Right. And with his facial expression, I think she doubted if she made the right call. Out, we have a challenge of the referees in call. <laughs> in call puts us at 9 I think they're still smiling. After review, the referees in call stands. The challenge was lost and a timeout is lost. We resume play at 9-3-2. No timeouts, no challenges, two timeouts. So the referee call stands, which was actually inbounds. Time in. 9-3-2.
Side out. And a quick side out. That's a great response. Yeah, Dazon really stuck that volley. Caught Ben leaning to the one. middle. Second serve. Three, not two. Start out. Sometimes a change in tempo can be just as destructive. Yeah, for sure. Dazon frustrated with herself after those thirds. She's been playing three, great one. all day. Point. One more for Annalie Waters and Ben Johns. 11-1, 10-3. Oh, she wanted it all. Second serve. <laughs> She's swinging free at the moment, <laughs> and good Ten, for three, her because that normally works. <gasps> oh boy, Federico Stacksrud slides the backhand for the ATP. And he did not have a lot of room to work Three, 10, with. One. Looked like he curled that ball with some side spin to help that angle open up. Second serve. Megan Dazon struggling a little right now from the baseline in terms of her third. 3 10, two. Ben Johns comes flying across. I'm not sure there's a little extra noise happening. Fans, I think, wanted this to be something else. Yeah, I think they're using a new ball here. <laughs> In three, one. Match point again. And out of bounds, so Ben Johns and Anna Lee Waters.